know what it is I love about being Spider-Man? Everything. One of the things that strikes you about the movie is just how intimate it is. So how do you guys go about creating that space on set where you can have those moments? You're right, it's a real coup, I think, to be able to pull off something small in something so enormous. You wanted to be the hero. Now you gotta pay the price. Luckily, we had a director, Mark Webb. The director of the film, Mr. Mark Webb. Who, the only movie he did before was this incredibly intimate love story. You should know up front, this is not a love story. Obviously, his first movie was 500 Days of Summer, so love stories. This is not a love story. He's an expert on love stories. It's not a love story. That was really important to him, so he was great at keeping it low-key enough to connect. She's kissed me. Right. How'd you like it? I felt a little bit rushed. I it totally works. Just conveying that. It completely works. Sweet. I'm coming with you. Okay, you know okay, that you okay, need me. Sure. Yeah, I can. You're coming with me. Shut the thing. Sorry, I love you. Don't hate me. Peter! I also want to ask you about something that we're not going to see in the movie, which is Charlene Woodley's performance as Mary Jane Watson, which ended up getting cut. Mm -hmm. Did you get rid of her? Yeah. I took her out. She had to go. Shailene is an incredible talent. Amazing, you know, That's yeah. undeniable. And the character not being in this movie had nothing to do with her, nothing to do with the scenes we shot, nothing to do with anything outside of we realized there should be only be one woman in, in, in Peter's life, and that woman is Gwen. You're Spider-Man, and I love that. But I love Peter Parker more. I just want to head back to the early days of your career, because... Let's when... make the long trek yeah. back. <laughs> All right. Like sands through the hourglass. Here we <laughs> These are. These are the days of our lives. Moving to Hollywood when you were 14? 15. 15, right. Yeah. But you convinced them with a PowerPoint presentation? Correct, Amanda. No one's ever been convinced by anything by PowerPoint presentation. How really? does that work? Really? Are you positive? Are there pie charts involved? There were no pie charts. I used clip art. Okay, right. I definitely Excellent. used clip art, yeah. So what clip art helps you sell your parents on the idea of moving to Hollywood? Uh, like a talking stapler, a pair of scissors that were, this will be my heart if you don't let me go. No, I'm just kidding. Here is Alexis Murrow and Emily Stone. Many times I've tried to tell you, many times I've cried alone. Always I'm surprised how well you cut my feelings to the bone. I mean, it's kind of insane to move at 15. It's completely insane. But they were really supportive. I had been acting for a while as a kid, and I really, I mean, I really do love it, you guys. I love it. Please let me go. <laughs> Everyone in the I'm room is still convinced. Still making all the time. <laughs> Please just let me go. Where are you? First in Broadway, second in Broadway, third in Broadway. Uh, five minutes, 10 tops. Are those sirens? No. What is happening? I'll be right there, promise. <laughs> But when you get there, though, that life of, of auditions is a hard yeah. slog. Because I guess the, the job of being an actor is that you have to keep your emotions very close to the surface, but at the same time, yeah. you've got to build up that callus as well. That was, there was, someone asked me once, a journalist asked me, uh, how do you keep your skin thin? Which I thought was a really good question, because you really can't form a thick skin if you're going to do your job well. And then you realise um, they were just after skincare tips, and they weren't after that at it all. It was about melanoma prevention. Oh my god! Yes. That would have so been awkward. So I was like, oh my god, that's, what a great question, so emotional. And he was like, yeah, what SPF do you use? <laughs> <laughs> Heal. Gotcha. Emma Stone, you're yes. fun to talk to. You're fun to talk to. Go you. Go you. High five. Ah.